put on an example two. 15% of 300 is what number? So it's again a percent sentence problem. As soon as I say it's percent sentence problem, I go immediately to fraction bar equals fraction bar, 100 in the denominator. Always create a proportion first. It's always 100 every single time. Okay. The percent we can see is 15%. I know that because it has the word percent next to it. Be careful when they use words to describe things, like if it says um, 230. Sometimes people don't see the 30. So 15%, 15 goes over 100. Percent always goes over 100. Then again, we have of, which is next to 300 only. And we have is next to also 300 and also what number. So where does 300 go? Uh, it's on the bottom. It's on the bottom. Because again, 300 is the only option for of, so it has to be the of number. And once we use 300 for of, we throw that option out for is, so the only is left is what number, so x goes there. All right, so again, priority one, get the percent proportion filled out properly. Objective two, cross multiplying, going back to what Preston asked in the last problem. If I see reduction possibilities, for example, 15 and 100 both divide by 5, that's legal. 300 and 100 both divide by 100, that's also legal. The only reductions illegal would be diagonal reductions, you can't do that. So. This number, horizontally position of that number in a proportion, fraction equals fraction, you can reduce that that way. Divide both numbers by 100. What we're left with is 3 and 1 don't reduce, 15 and 1 don't reduce, so we can't reduce anymore. Then if I cross multiply, 1 times x is x, 3 times 15 is 45. Did you just say 100 times 3 is 315 times 3 is 45? Yeah. I mean, if you, if you wanted to look at it a scale factor idea, 100 times 3 is 300, so 15 times 3 is 45. That's legal. That works. Um, right now, they're going to be friendly enough. They work that way. Eventually, they might come out decimals, and they yeah. wouldn't work as nicely. So cross-multiplying always results in a correct answer. Um, that would be my first choice for a technique, but that scale factor idea works also.